Hello everyone. Welcome to Microsoft Teams. In this video, we will learn about all the permissions that a team owner has in Microsoft Teams. So in this example, I'm going to go into the settings of the team owner and I'm going to click on manage team. Now here I can see all of the members in my team. I can go into channels and I can see all of the channels that I have within the team. I can then go to the settings and I can decide whether I want to have a team picture. I can also decide what are the member permissions that I want to use. So for example, I want to say that members can create and update channels. Members should not be able to edit the message. Members should not delete any messages. So these are some of the settings that I can go ahead and define as a team owner. I can also decide what are the guest permissions. So for example, we added a guest in an earlier video to the team. I can decide that the guest should not be able to create and update channels. The guest should not be able to delete the channel. I can also define a team code. So a team code is a very useful method by which you can join the team. So as an owner of the team, I can create this team code. I can copy this using on the clipboard and then I can send this instruction to anybody else who wants to join the team. So how would you join the team using this code? You can click on join or create a team, enter this code here and that's it. You can join the team. Let me go back to the settings. You can also decide on making somebody a, a member or an owner. So that's a high level overview of what the team owners can do. Thank you.